Kanye West broke down amid a bizarre presidential campaign rally over the weekend. Despite rumors he dropped out of the 2020 presidential race, Kanye held his first campaign event in South Carolina on Sunday night, which proved to be a little uncomfortable. The rambling speech, which was posted to social media by some in the crowd, including reporters, was met with numerous groans as the rapper and clothing designer made shocking statements, such as this one posted by reporter Phil Lewis. Well, Harriet Tubman never actually freed the slaves. She just had the slaves go work for other white people. In another moment, Kanye shared a story about how he and wife Kim Kardashian West almost had an abortion, at which point he grew emotional about his past and his father. Hysterically crying on stage, the stunned crowd offered applause and shouted positive messages to West in an attempt to calm him down. Other videos also shows Kanye kicking someone out of the event for heckling. The surprise rally was held at the Equus Event Center in North Charleston and was, quote, for registered guests only. According to ABC News, all attendees were asked to sign a COVID-19 liability release form, social distance, and wear a mask. The rapper teased the event after taking to social media on Saturday, writing, Hi guys, please sign up to put me on the ballot in South Carolina at any of these locations. You can also sign up at the website Kanye2020.country. That very same day, West also appeared to tease his next album, Donda, in a tweet that he has since deleted, but screenshots of the tracklist have circulated online. Kanye's first rally comes shortly after the rapper announced over 4th of July weekend that he planned to run for president in 2020, tweeting, We must now realize the promise of America by trusting God, unifying our vision, and building our future. I'm running for president of the United States. Hashtag 2020 vision. For more on this story, head to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Neha Joy.